Mr. Jack Scalia, Mr. President. Yes. Nice to see you again. How do you do? You guys have film today? <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you get our heads in, okay? That's all I want to know. Mary Ellen. Uh, no. We met in the Century Plaza Towers just uh, six months ago. Mary Ellen Bennett. Thank you. Yvonne Fetterman. Yes. Yvonne Fetterman. Hello, I Hello. think you're Dallas Howard. Nice to see you. Thank you. That's Sarah O'Mara. Hello, Chris. Hello, Dan. Nice to see you. We appreciate your meeting with us today. Well, listen, you, I appreciate all of you and what you're doing in this wonderful undertaking. Thank you. Thank you. Abuse children. Caring for, for them, but trying to make efforts to see that it happens less than it's been happening. That's for sure. As I remember, Bob Weinberg. That's right, absolutely. Yes. You know, we're here, Mr. President, because of Child Help USA. Yes. That's the largest nonprofit organization in the child abuse field. The first thing I want to tell you is how appreciative we are of the seven years that you have given for children's issues. You have made the biggest difference in all time, I think, for children's issues. And we're well, so grateful you. for that. And we have the National Child Abuse Hotline. The statistics are up 16% this year, but we feel it's because of the awareness that because people know where to go to get help, and that's very good. We had the national press conference here on Tuesday, and Phyllis Diller, and of course Jack, and Ephraim Zimbalist, and Cheryl Ladd were all here. They wanted to come so badly oh, today golly. to well. meet you, but they couldn't stay over because of their schedules. Oh. But that press conference went out nationwide, even internationally, we hear that they picked it up. So we're very grateful for that. Well, we're appre we appreciate Nancy being an honorary chairman of our national yes. campaign. And she's done so much for us. She did our PSAs for our hotline. And as Sarah said, our calls were up and we received over 150,000 phone calls this last year. Mm -hmm. And we're sure those PSAs that Nancy made really were responsible for a lot of them. So you've been wonderful well, both of you. We appreciate well, I want to do a little bit of help too. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you, too. For you and Nancy are a beautiful example to all of us. You do show such Thank love and respect I don't know if we can cash Thank this, you. Mr. President. <laughs> I can, I've got change. Wait a second. I've got change right here. We also hear just, oh, God bless you. just some souvenirs. Oh, oh how season. wonderful. Thank you so much. That God is so you. wonderful. You make us cry. Thank you very much. <laughs> no, no, it's what Thank you're you. doing. And you're a wonderful person. It's such a wonderful part of what I think this country is so unique for, and that is the private sector doing things instead of turning to government and saying, Give me a tip. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, our budget is over $7 million, and we don't have asked the government for any help except for our research. And yeah. so we raise about $6 million a year. Well, but we're going to be asking for money very soon. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yes, go ahead, you know, That's your part. It's, it's what finally happened. You know, we were the only country ever doing anything like all these things, all the charitable things. and and education support and everything. But you know, this, uh, uh, but you know now that it has changed, and yes. just a short time ago, people from America met with others from all over the world in Paris, France, and now the other countries, particularly the European countries, are now creating private sector. Yes, right. you did that. See what you, you started? Did that. You That's started right. it off. That's right. But you know, this uh, this February, or is it March, one Next of the time. months that uh, right. when you're going to be living in California, we have the uh, NFLPA, the National Football League Players Association, and it'll be our fourth uh, annual dinner with them. And we'd like to have you and Mrs. Reagan as our honored guests if uh, you have the time to do it. Well, and rub shoulders with the big boys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm an old footballer okay. myself. That's yeah. right, so I hear. We've shown your clips at our other events, so we'd like to have <laughs> you there in person for Ivana. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we're yeah. going to do, do a quick. Ivana and, and uh, Sarah sure. are going to have a photo with you before we go. Here's some sort of the founders. I wonder if he should present the check to us. We're so proud of this. <laughs> <laughs> I think yeah. that would be wonderful. <laughs> Well, That's wonderful. God bless you. God well, bless you. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Well, thank you, Mr. President. Well, I've got your thanks. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. Well, bless you for what you're doing. Thank you again. Such a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.
Thank you. Have a nice evening. Nice seeing you again, Mr. Mayor. Nice seeing you. Excuse me. Thank you very much for your time. Yes. Charles Smith, Commissioner of Education. This case, I am. I'm Terry Weeks, principal. Nice to see you. Good see you, President. Here's our President teacher. Terry Weeks. Hello. 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 Nice to meet you. Okay. Okay. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Hold that. We've got to get our press in here. We didn't come in the right order. This is a good place for me to hold it, I tell you. We have had the press coming now. It was held at the perfect spot. Well, I've read something of what you've done. I admire it greatly. Central America. Well, thank Antonio you. Antonio Mono. Nice to see you. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And Anna O'Brien. Hello. Hello. 
because this I'm gonna I'm gonna be helping as much as I can but the White House and let's at least give the president the next president a, a majority in the Senate again I know we can't catch up all at once in one election with the house but I tell you the difference between my first six years when we had a majority in the one house the Senate and now that they have the majority it's just night and day we never could have accomplished what we did if we hadn't had that one house. Yes, sure, yes, sir. So I found out the way I appeal to the people when you're campaigning just as a suggestion, you say mm -hmm. to them, you're going to send so-and-so as president and send some people up there to help him. <laughs> <laughs> well, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. First time, maybe he's let me out of the office. <laughs> it's a particular pleasure because of that. Thank you so much. I look forward to working with you. Mr. President, we're bringing in uh, Judy Hope, who is the uh, nominee, as you know, for the D.C. Circuit, taking Judge Bork's seat. And uh, uh, you had talked to her previously. Uh, I also will remind you she's uh, Bob Hope's daughter in law, as you know. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we do have still photographers coming in to take a picture. They'll come in first. Reading over here and then I'll leave and that's it. Stills are coming first. Interesting process, and I thank you. Well, welcome aboard. Thank you very much. We'll see how it goes. All right. Okay. Thank you. 